<laughs> then make a freshman mistake um, and get caught back door, but made up for it with his athleticism. Got away with it that time. Trevor Anderson wraps a pass around to Carlson, the freshman with back-to-back -back buckets for Wisconsin. Those are the veterans. Those are the guys that have been through this program and know the rules that they need to stick by. A nice look here from uh, Nate Reavers from Micah Potter there. That's the second time he has been left that open. Anderson to trigger. Alley-oop. Nice screen by uh, Tyler Wall there. He pinned Nate Reavers' guy down, so he was just able to go up and... Uh, Tyler Wall using the 15 pounds of added strength, pinning Nate Reavers' guy. If you're Eastern Illinois in that situation, you got to be ready to switch that. Potter guarded by Dixon. What a drop-off by Potter to find Trice. Wasn't a charge. Good cut by Johnny Davis again. His man turned. Oh, who that is. That, it, it occasionally went in once or twice, but uh, we, Coach Ryan let me shoot him enough. There's a lean Ford filling it up again. Ford with eight points. Do that right now because of the free redshirt year. So I'm excited for these freshmen because they get game experience, and there's nothing like game experience. Great feed down low to Nate Reavers. That comes a little bit more pressure. There's no question about it. Having lived it, it's one of those things you realize it. Talk to Coach Gard about it. He says, we don't talk about that at all in the, in the locker room. Consistency on offense. Maybe this is the shot they need to get going. Wisconsin has three turnovers. Let's see if they get a good possession here. They're only averaging six and a half turnovers the whole game. Oh, Micah Potter punishing the rim. That'll do it. That'll do it. Trevor Anderson, nothing was light about this dunk. Jeff, if you touch the post, good things happen. Now I know that's coming from a seven-footer, but that looks pretty good to me. My goodness, that is a great finish. You see Brad Davidson try to go over the top of that and blow up that screen. Wall goes baseline, kicks to a wide-open Davison. That's pretty. Hey, anytime you put your hands on a player, it's a foul. Here you see Tyler Wall, great offensive execution. He gets the help, he skips it baseline. Really good basketball IQ there by Tyler. And forces that turnover into the hands. Two on one behind the back. Tyler Wall finishes. Nice transition. Ended up being the only three pointer made by Green Bay in that first half. And Nate Reavers. Reavers and be grateful to play and execute and compete and do the best you can tonight a perfect example this place is usually packed for this game and this rivalry off the lewis misfire trice pushing davison great feed to potter rim running senior we're not at up at 35. opportunity fast break got to share the ball in transition that extra pass, the hockey assist. Tracking Trevor Anderson's foot to see if it was going to go out of bounds. It looked like he kept it in. Good pass underneath. Wall to Jonathan Davis. It's a very well-coached team. It's a very disciplined team and an experienced team. And I think that's what you hit around the head, experienced team. Potter knocks down the triple. Congratulations to them. Here comes a lean forward. Nice feed and a wide open lane. He opened up for Ford, right? Huge. And you look at this, anything they want, they're getting on the offensive end. They've got 23. Whether fans or not, it's a difficult place to play because of, of the team that you're playing. Is it so hard to turn Wisconsin over? I mean, yeah. the Badgers don't have a turnover yet. Beautiful high low. Wisconsin was ready to play. Wall at the elbow, swings it to a wide open Davison. And just another great possession. Just beautiful. Nebraska really feels like his heart is in the right place. He's focused on getting better off the court as much as he is on the court. And Reavers finally with a two-point field goal for Wisconsin, their first of the game. Davidson, what a pass. And Aline Ford puts it home. <laughs> and Davidson put a little mustard on that hot dog to lean forward with the easy deuce. Brad Davidson known for his scoring. We got a little Rocket Watts, floater, no. Tapped out though by Kithier. Ford saving it to Demetric Trice. Outlet up ahead. 
And Johnny Davis lays it in. Wisconsin's up eight. Bizzo takes a timeout. Well, again, hustle plays, the little things to keep the ball available and alive. As a result, you get a transition basket. Seven first half points for Trice on the heels of his 29 point performance against Michigan State. Here's Anderson's three, and that rattles home. Well, that was a great skip pass by Dimitri Trice. Davis popping free for a good look from three. Long rebound to Potter. Here's Trice off the fake. Finds Davis on the baseline. It's like the mix of the old school, like, cream color, mm -hmm. which I know Indiana fans will appreciate, and then the script. I really like the script. Yeah, I, I like that as well. Oh, nice I like that job. pass there, yeah. like, from Trice getting it down to Potter. Watch Michael Potter. Dimitri Trice holds it just long enough so that he can free himself at the rim. The pass was in the shooting pocket. He lifted it about as easy as it could be lifted up. Here's Potter to try to answer. He does. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> they can use Jim Pernarco out there. Look at that backdoor cut by Trice and uses the left hand. Yeah, coming off a break. It's a nice set from the outside. So you take a look. Watch on the right side. Little up. You come up towards the ball. Your defender thinks you're going to come and almost either do a weave or a handoff. Leading score, Demetri Trice, 15 a game. Cross court skip, Davison. Pretty pass, pretty shot. Well, take a look at this pass by Demetric Trice and over the top of the high hands, Anthony Gaines. You are putting him in such a out there. Davison finding on the baseline. Johnny Davis with a plot. His offense kind of struggled Friday night at Rutgers, but tonight so far so good. They are totally in sync. The ball is moving, and Jonathan Davis is hanging on rims. Essentially, this is a six-year senior out there, although he's by rule a fifth-year senior. Boy, great, great cut. Great cut. And now a new career high, or season high, I should say, for Trevor Anders. This screen right here, and it's just a big-time back screen. He gets the freshman. They're picking on Ty Berry, and Trevor Anderson takes it right to the basket. This half, the Buckeyes are 8 of 11 from the floor. Nice play there, though, as Davis puts in two. Davison's ear... Nice connection there. Akeem Hart with his first two, and now they go right at Hart and two for Micah Potter. And they'll have to face, as we, as we mentioned, Wisconsin twice in a row. They'll play again on Tuesday in that scheduling court. As that bucket is up and inside a wall, a half dozen already. You attack the basket, you can do it in a variety of ways. Tyler Wall does that. A couple of steals for Penn State already. They are number one in the league in that category. Nate Reavers hesitation and up and in. You know, I had him on my unsung heroes list, but he's scoring too much now. <laughs> Gotta uh, slow down, John. He has really come on. He's rebounding the ball as well as anybody in the conference. What a sequence for Sessoms. Final seconds. Trice Davison at the horn. Yes! Good end to an entertaining first half. He's keeping his handle. Draws two defenders, kicks out to Davidson. Davidson holds a follow through. That's a nice finish. As he can knock him down from the outside. And you forget about him because of Frazier and because of Io. And Potter able to get free of Coburn for the two hand flush. Trice in transition. That three not going to go. Bodies down under the basket and Wall. The bounce back to Wall. Coburn shows up. Bucket and a foul. A scramble, but it turns into a chance at a three-point play. On Morris, I'm Kevin Kugler. We welcome you inside Pinnacle Bank Arena. Just underway, Wisconsin with the opening tip and the field inside to Nate Reavers back in the starting lineup tonight. And Reavers gives Wisconsin the early 2 nothing end. Trice will inbound for Wisconsin. Micah Potter, who did not start on the floor now for the Badgers. And they go right inside to Potter, who gets to the rim for an easy two. Five-time Big Ten Freshman of the Week. The nice, Catholic. nice feed. Oh, and there's the 13th point falling for four. For Iowa, nobody questions whether or not this Hawkeye team can score. They average 87 and a half points a game. They're in the top three in America in scoring offenses. Potter gets inside and scores with the left hand. Right, talking about like the telegraph is to us. <laughs> That's ancient technology, but he had a VCR and a bunch of old VHS tapes as Potter goes back door and throws it down. That shot down with a lot of confidence. That's big. He did not score against Illinois. Another guy that fouled out in 14 minutes. 
And Micah Potter knocking it in from deep, coming off a season-high 23 against Iowa. Oh, I'm telling you. Ooh. How about that feed? Great number cut. two to number one. Great cut. This is where you get those extra couple points from a home game. Potter for Trice in the corner. Big shot. He's got it. You know, outside not going for the bigs. All right. Don't force. Good play by Potter. He found it. And Trent Frazier jumped out of the way. Amazing. He shot 22% from three coming into tonight. And now Potter dunks it home with a foul. Because you don't have to be locked into Wheeler. And then how about this pass? Demetric Trice. All right, 19 and 6 rebounds against Nebraska in the blowout. Davison taking contact and still able to finish. He just steps in every once in a while. You forget he's there. You're so focused on Bohannon and Garza. There's Potter again. He's got four of the six for the Badgers out of the gate. But a lot of guys in the black uniforms trying to look at the ball. You lose what's behind. And Reavers was able to keep him in front. Nice slip. And the nice slam. Lean forward. He's got to take that. He's got to keep the defense honest. That's a good look. About 30% this year from three. Oh, what a good look inside to a lead forward. How is he so?